say can you see by the dawn's early light? Hey guys, it's Adam Olson with the Adam Olson team in Abbey Realty. Today we're at Sam Houston State University at Don Sander Stadium, about to bring you an amazing performance by Joe Everson. Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. Welcome, Joe. Welcome to Huntsville. We're glad to have you out here for this performance. Yeah, thank you. Awesome to be here. Beautiful day. Ready for a great baseball okay. game today. That's awesome. Well, you know, you've completely excelled at your work uh, and performances around the world. What do you credit that to? I was born and raised in a family that was very musical and somewhat artsy, of course, and I kind of grew up thinking that all kids grew up with, uh, you know, voice lessons, things like that, <laughs> and, uh, you know, like that's a normal thing. So it wasn't really until later on in life that I started bringing those things together and, and honing them in, but it takes a lot of hard work. It takes that drive to figure out what what you do better and how to make yourself better at what you do. Tell me about how you came up with a concept to uh, paint upside down, singing the national anthem, and then flipping it around. How'd you come up with that? Honestly, I'd seen and been inspired by other action painters, and just the idea of having a reveal at the end was really exciting and fun. And uh, I thought, man, I'd like to do that, but how could I do it in my own way? You know, take on. The, yeah, the Joe version of what what's going on. And it took about six months to perfect the first idea and kind of bring it all together and into what is now performed today, so. And uh, I know it's completely changed, uh, you know, your business and your life. Well, honestly, I'd been slinging prints, if you will, at art shows for a number of years and had a dream to become, you know, this artist that was very collectible. And that's still the primary dream. But getting us there is this performance idea. And I think it's so amazing the places I've been able to go with it. And we knew it could be big, but I could never say I thought it would be that big. So you, you paint a lot of different murals. What would be your favorite mural to paint? Uh, so it's really hard to say that one is better than the other or anything like that. But obviously your first is, is that first love, you know, and uh, it's still pretty much a favorite. I think a lot of people remember watching a video online, and so they're really attached to that one in many ways. And so when it comes to performance paintings, uh, that's probably a favorite. It has special meaning to me too. We're standing here today at Sam Houston State University. What would be your advice to an art student? There's so many ways I could go with this. I think one of the biggest things that I've learned as an artist you know, I was at that point where I was literally doing the starving artist thing. And some artists are gonna have that, that shot and be able to go with it, similar to what I had for myself. And there's so many different avenues that sometimes it gets confusing. And I think one of the key things to do is to be very, very uh, moldable, very, very pliable and ready to just take on anything that comes next. Because you're gonna be in your studio pumping out as much as you can, trying to figure out what it is that's your style, finding who you are, and you gotta you gotta keep digging, keep doing that, but don't forget about the hustle side of things. Getting outside of yourself and tar starting to uh, uh, talk to people about what you do is a great place to start, um, I think, because it really starts getting what you do in front of other people and that's the key you know having some humility in that and then pride in in the fact that you know you have the confidence to do something great and you have something to offer you know so joe thank you so much for coming out and uh, sharing this opportunity with us and everyone here at the sam game today oh man thank you so much it's uh, it's a privilege and an honor to do what i do and especially at a wonderful college like this and uh, uh thank you if you want to see more of my art by the way definitely check out Joe Everson Art at Joe Everson Art for Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, of course. Thank you. And the whole